So we had a case of a six-year-old boy who fell while playing uh, in California. They went to Stanford General Hospital and uh, this child could not see with one eye at all after the fall. And no one could even identify. They went for three consecutive days there to Stanford General Hospital. No one could identify what the actual problem was because the front of the eye was fine, the back of the eye was fine, the bone structure was fine, the brain MRI was fine, everything was fine. Actually, the leader of this group called Swami Samarth, a uh, very spiritual group, very big group, he told us, uh, he told them to come to us directly. So they took a flight to come here. Um, we tested that boy for with our vision assessment and a visual field assessment. We found that that child could see through a little hole with that eye that was lost. But and then we also made, did some tests which identified that it was a traumatic optic neuritis, which means that his optic nerve was damaged after the fall. But some of the doctors in the family, in their family, said that no, this is we don't want to try this. The core treatment is steroids. So they vanished for a week after the consultation. We did not see them. Uh, and uh, they took steroids. Eventually, after eight days, I got a call from that person again. So, Sir, please, I'm, we're going to come back to you. Please see what you can do. So we tested the boy again. And even that little hole was now gone. So that boy could not see anything with that uh, eye. Even though we were ourselves not sure about if we can now help that person or not, because it was too late now in terms of the hours, because all this is very time bound, how much improvement you can see after a fall. Um, but we started treating that boy after 35 days, we recovered 70% of his vision. And uh, still the boy and the family keeps, uh, they keep calling us, they keep thanking us for what we've done to them because it was a six-year-old boy. You know, he could have lost his eyesight forever. 